This is a floating bookshelf that we're going to put together for you and show you how this uh, uh, works. It's a very simple DIY. I and love And we are it. going to pool our talents together and make this thing happen. Okay. All right. So uh, we need to find out first what we need to make these. Perfect. Here's what you're going to need. Some angle brackets, depending upon the size of the shelf you want to put in and the size of the book that you're going to use for your base will determine your angle bracket itself. These are very affordable. Any home goods store that, or home improvement store, very, very affordable. You're going to need a couple of wall anchors. Uh, these come in different loads, meaning they can be 20 pounds, 30, up to 100 pounds and they'll be much wider. These screw right into drywall, okay? Don't use them, um, they're for sheer weight this way. Don't use them to hang in the ceiling because they'll pull out. Pull out, okay. Okay, you're gonna need the washers and you'll need some screws and you're gonna need a good base, which is a book, a book you no longer really use, a pencil, a little level, tape measure, and if you wanna try to put this into the stud, you need a stud finder, okay? Okay, a and a glue, and you, did you say glue gun? Yes, we'll okay. need a glue gun as well. All right. Okay. Uh, Okay. So what is next? What okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna build the base of, first of all, this is the foundation. We're gonna build this. I'm gonna show you how this works. So right now, you can see how this is put in here. And uh, so you start out with a book. We're gonna use the smaller angles. So we know this is gonna be the outside of the book, the shelf itself. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in, and now you wanna put the angle brackets in. Let's pretend this is the wall over here, Christina, right? Mm -hmm. So the angle brackets are gonna be down below here. We don't wanna put them up here like this. We'll put them on the lower side of this. It gives us more to, we're gonna screw into these, okay? okay? Right. You wanna position these uh, about even. You don't have to get too uh, worried about it. You just wanna make sure it's kinda equal because this is gonna be the base of your shelf. Looks like a good okay? inch, inch yeah, and a smidge. Right? Okay. An inch and a smidge. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna screw these in to the, uh, to the paper? Yeah, we're gonna okay. screw this in. Now, you leave an extra page if you want. Well, actually, we're gonna put this underneath here because we're gonna glue this right to, right. when we're done, we're gonna right. use the glue gun to glue this. So let's bring this to the edge. And now we're just gonna screw these. If Could you hand me the drill sure. over there? Sure. Okay. Oh, and we forgot and we these, need a drill. Yeah, we need a drill. Okay. Mostly because my finger doesn't work anymore <laughs> like that. I used to use it. Right. So you're, uh, uh, we're going to demo this just a little bit here. So you'll go into your book and you can screw right in. You may want to be tempted to um, glue the pages together to make it more of a solid. Um, there we go. Kind of have that back towards me a little bit, mm -hmm. but um, but um, and you could do that if you wanted to make this more of a solid. But they're individuals now, and Oops. just go down like that. So okay. you would go on down the line and you would attach this. This is the way okay. you would go. Then when you're finished with it, you take your glue gun and you're gonna drop glue droplets along here, along here like this, and then you will close it. So let's move on to the next one that we have. Okay, so it looks like this when so, it's done. So, yes. Right? Okay. All right, so right, this glued. is, yeah. Oh. Well, that goes this way because we're gonna put what's gonna okay. go onto the shelf, shelf like Shelf like that, okay. Okay, and we have glued this already along here, so. Okay, we're we gonna roll in our little video yeah. pre-tape of how to do so this. So this so is how, now you're gonna put this on the wall, and then when you do this, you are going to use these wall anchors, so you have your six holes, and I would recommend if you can find a stud, use a stud, if not, you're gonna wanna go use the wall anchors. If you're gonna put a lot of books on these, you wanna go heavy um, with the big anchors. And you'll go ahead, and now we use, remember this old trick I showed you about catching the soot when you're screwing into the wall? The oh, I love that. Off? Christina can come over here, yes. you can help mm -hmm. hold in a minute, but go ahead and these little screw right through the drywall. I use these all the time. Remember, it's for hanging things on the wall, not from the ceiling down, because they will pull out. And if you take that off, away you go. Perfect, see, that could have been all over the floor, and then I have to get the vacuum out and clean. All right, so here's where we are. We have our bookshelf. We're ready to go. We have our anchors in, and all you need to do, now here's the tip, do not take the first one and screw it all the way in. Just Why? get it started, because when you do it, it'll, it'll kind of bind this all to the wall already. We may need to move this around just to get it settled. Okay. So we can start little by little. There Beautiful. you go. Can I let go Perfect. now or not? You should be able to let it hang. Okay. And it should be fine. And then I'm going to go ahead and tighten these up. Now, what, when you do something like this, again, if you're using it and you can go right into a stud, the better. If not, you want to take a look at your book and the size of the book and make sure you're putting the biggest book that you're going to use on the bottom of your rack, okay? So 
While you're doing that, I'm going to dress our little desk. Yeah. Okay. You go ahead and do that. I'm going to put these last two in, and then I will sink them up tight. Sometimes when you put these in, if you do not get it lined up correctly, you need to have a little play, a little give room before you go ahead and do this. And that one's in. Now we're coming over here. This is very easy. And it, once it goes in, you can see the other ones behind me and how they are just sort of suspended there. This goes in here. Boom, we're set like that. Christina, there's a stack of books behind. I see the books over here. Bring okay. those over. They are set. I have one last screw. Okay, and then this is the last. The brackets in. Where is that? Got our two brackets up. Brackets, the clue word. Oh, I said the clue. Oh, bo yam man. They're steel drum and going off a man. Look at there we go. Look at that. Perfect. Perfect. I have a couple more things. I love this. Okay, these are all the things that you picked out, Mark, that you wanted for your desk here. Yeah. So we're just going to arrange them nicely. They're there. And all you're giving up. Remember, use the a book you're not interested anymore a big coffee table book at the bottom. 